All right, I'm going to be showing off a little of the capabilities of the macro settings on the new Samsung Galaxy Camera 2. So to start with, we need to turn on the camera itself, bring up the display, and then in the bottom left, you always have this camera icon. So we'll turn on the camera, and then to set macro, you just go to mode, and it brings up these options. The smart is where all the presets for a lot of the uh, things like landscape or uh, sunsets, and then there's also the macro. So we'll pick the macro. And I'm going to go ahead and put this on a little tripod here just to make sure we're steady for the shot. And that way we'll get the most clarity possible. And then we'll go ahead and take a couple pictures. So to start with, I've got a bottle cap sitting there. And... I am shadowing my picture here a little bit, but that's okay. Uh, I'm under incandescent lights too, just so you know. And we'll just tap the screen where we want the image to focus. I just set the timer so that there would be even less shake from me pressing the shutter button. And then we'll go ahead and take the picture. So pick the area we want to focus. I go ahead and hit the shutter button. The timer goes off. Boom. And there's our picture. So let's zoom in here a little bit. I'm not sure if you can see it in the video, but there is a lot of detail that you can see in this. You can see the little pits in the paint. Uh, texture of the paint, a lot of detail. I'll post these pictures on my blog and post the link in the description of this video. You should also see a link popping up right now on the screen that you can click to go see these photos in high resolution. I'll post the exact pictures that I took here. Um, and another sample picture we'll do, we'll take a couple of these finishing nails here and we'll lay them out. And press the shutter button to get back to the uh, camera screen and we'll pick our area where we want to focus here uh, let's try right there focus right on that little intersection there so again I have the timer set I'm going to hit the shutter button oh, our focus point move there Alright, so now I'm going to half press, it'll lock the focus, press, one second, two seconds, boom, there goes our picture. Alright, so again, let's enlarge this picture, and you can see there's some amazing clarity there. Uh, you can see the little rust spots on the nails, you can see every little ding and dent in them, very good uh, quality macro photos from this camera. I'm quite pleased, uh, so especially if you use something like a small tripod or something to stabilize the camera. Uh, the better lighting, obviously, you're going to get better pictures. But again, this uh, camera has some pretty amazing uh, capabilities as far as macro. You can literally get the camera within an inch or two of what you're taking the photo of. If you're too far away from what you're photographing in the macro mode it will actually say you need to get closer I'm not sure if I can get it to do that yeah you can see there when I half pressed the button it was telling me that I needed to get closer to the image to get the desired results so that's it um, I'll post these exact pictures I took here on my blog so you can see for yourself the resolution of these photos so hopefully you found this useful if you did, hit the like button, and be sure and visit my blog for the full-size images. Thanks for watching.